believe it or not, this one tiny little polyurethane bushing can completely transform the feeling you get out of this truck. It completely changes the ride. It feels far more stable. You feel far more connected to the rear of the board. If you want to ride a rear foot style ride, it just completely dials in your rear foot and it is game changer. So let me show you how to add this bushing to your HST truck. So I'm gonna get my little workbench. X tool. So I'll take the existing HST truck and I'm gonna clamp it down, but that's pretty much the same as whenever you have your truck clamped down on your deck. Just turn your deck upside down. So I'll go ahead and take out the kingpin. The lock nut comes off. This is the bottom half of the wave cam and the cam key. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to push the hanger out. So the hanger tabs are coming out through this slot in the side of the base plate and they'll go back in the same way. So I still have my washer, my spring, and then what we do is we take this cone bushing cone side down and we set it inside the spring. It fits in there just right. And we put this washer on and then we slide the hanger in with the hanger tabs coming through that slot in the base plate. And then we'll put the wave cam back together, tuck it up in the pivot cup, and I'll just squeeze it here and give it a little twist. Then I'm going to put the kingpin in. And then I'm going to put the lock nut bat on, back on. And then I'll tighten it up. Now what I like to do whenever I put this bushing in is I don't really like to tighten it all the way down. I'll actually tighten it so that I just feel the kingpin cup poking through the lock nut to make sure all the threads are exposed because that leaves with, with a lot of play. It's much stiffer. It's much more stable than it would have been without it. But if you've got a really heavy rider or somebody who's riding real hard, you can tighten it all the way down till it stops and it'll still work. It's just much, much stiffer. But if you're a lighter rider or you like it to be looser, I would leave it so that the kingpin is just poking through that lock nut this will be totally different, different better. So you get the best of both worlds whenever you add that little bushing to your HST 2.0. It's gonna feel more connected, especially on the rear of the board. And uh, it's gonna be more flowy and more responsive. And you won't have to worry about wobble or feeling too loose. It will not feel too loose. And you get all the board lean and all the carve you had before it's just you get a more stable ride.